in Lavenham, the Wildlife Art Gallery specialises in contemporary wildlife art, including paintings, prints and sculpture. The gallery was opened in 1988 and has a strong representation of paintings depicting the countryside, its landscape and work. Alongside the contemporary work, the gallery has also held retrospective exhibitions by 20th century wildlife artists such as Peter Scott and Donald Watson. In a Georgian shop in the heart of Clare, Suffolk's smallest town, you will find a contemporary art gallery specialising in maritime inspired art. Sarah and Alaric Pugh run Sea Pictures Gallery, which stocks high quality original art in all media from artists across the UK. Exhibitions change every six weeks and many of the artists are members of the big painting societies such as the Royal Society of Marine Artists. The Melford famous Old House Gallery is a recent addition to Long Melford. The gallery exhibits traditional 19th and 20th century paintings without doubt the star attractions are the three paintings by Cortez which capture Parisian life from the early 1900s. The glassware from Australia comprises unique and individual pieces by the world-renowned Rish Gordon. The upstairs gallery in Beckles was named as one of the best small galleries in the UK by High 50. Owner Michelle Payne campaigns to get artists from East Anglia noticed, as well as working in-house in her studio at the gallery, life casting bodies and torsos, celebration and also emotional memorial casting across the region.